Why would they say that? Because of a few isolated incidents. I've come forward. I said I had drank in excess a few times. I've admitted to drug use, but I'm not a drug addict. I'm not an alcoholic. And I've I had some um, uh, fun time on the weekends. Yes, I have. I think everyone has. And I'm human. I made a mistake. Peter, I'm getting punished for my for my Friday or Saturday night that I decided to have a few drinks. And, a few too many drinks. And, and, right? Well, depending on what you consider drinking, sometimes people drink once or, uh, or two or three drinks and they're drunk. Well, I'm a big guy, you know. Um, I might give me a few more drinks than that, but this is all personal. This is, they call it democracy. This is not a democracy. This is a dictatorship. You know what happens when you get to a certain point? <laughs> when you're very, very inebriated? You remember this? You might not remember that. There's, there's this point, I hate to say it, there's this blackout period that I think we all have gone through. As a teenager or in university, some people drink to excess. Uh, again, I'm, some people are perfect. I'm not. Who in this park, or even who in the whole world, doesn't have problems? Who doesn't have a drink too many times once in a while, and maybe even winds up passed out in their own driveway, pissing themselves? Huh? I mean, serious. Well, who doesn't have a, a little puff from time to time? Or who doesn't have problems with the people they love? Randy. Everybody. And I apologize for my neglect of the things that are most important to me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Because this park is the most important thing in my life and it always will be and so will all of you. Because this is our home. This is our community. I am Jim Leahy, and I am your trailer park supervisor. Thanks for coming, Randy, everybody. <laughs>